New at 11, a man arrested for a hot prowl burglary in Clovis is now apparently making fun of the situation. A hot prowl burglary is when someone tries to break into your home while you're inside. Early this morning, Clovis police say that 24-year-old David Hernandez tried to use a 10-inch hunting knife to break into a woman's home. CBS 47's Medeiros Babb joins us live from the Clovis Police Department. Medeiros police spotted Hernandez on social media talking about the incident and mocking it tonight. After the incident this morning, there were many citizens that took to the Clovis Police Department's Facebook page to say it would probably be a catch and release. And that's when Hernandez took to the keyboard himself saying, quote, yep, laughing, crying emoji and quote, back at your mom's house. Very scary situation for the, the victim. Ring video around 315 Thursday morning reportedly shows 24 year old David Hernandez as he walks up to a home near Fallbrook and Peach Avenues. 15 minutes later, Clovis police got a 911 call from a frantic woman on the same block fearing for her life. They could hear the tone of voice. They could hear that it was a very serious situation. At 5 a.m., he was booked in the Fresno County Jail with his bail set at $15,000. At 12.30 p.m., he bonded out, and late that evening, he took to the Clovis Police Department's Facebook page. When you see that person several hours later on social media making fun of how quickly he's back out, it makes you think that uh, maybe he didn't learn his lesson. On the post, one user commented, quote, I'm sure he's already back on the street. Catch and release is the norm now. Hernandez replied to the post saying, quote, back to your mom's house, LOL. Further down on the post, another user commented, quote, probably arrest and release. Hernandez replied, quote, yep, with two laughing, crying emojis. And while it is disturbing to see, Clovis Lieutenant Jim Monroe says these instances are becoming more common. Like I said, it's disheartening to see that on social media because you would hope that someone that just spent some time in jail uh, for for their crime would uh, would maybe think before they post something like that. But um, you know, it is a public forum; it's able to be posted there, and everybody's got their First Amendment right, I guess. So. The sheriff's office says that back in 2019, Hernandez was also arrested and booked for a domestic violence incident. And the woman whose house was broken into tells police that she is terrified for not only her safety, but the safety of her family. Reporting live from Clovis, Madeira's Bab, CBS 47, Eyewitness News.